Hey guys, Jack Cassio, twicepeed.com. Now, we're at part four of the four part series, the instant vertical jump prescription. Now, I've already explained why I call it the vertical jump prescription, because you need that proper dose. You guys need to be doing the right things on the right days in order to become that explosive, powerful jumper that you wanna be. Now, this workout, the whole thing's gonna be put together in this video. So you guys have already seen part one through three. You're gonna put it all together in part four, and it's gonna become your vertical jump workout for you to test drive and see what happens to your vertical jump. Now, if you want serious inches on your vert, make sure by the end of this video, click the link in the description, and you're gonna find out exactly how you can add three inches to your vert in three minutes. Now, in today's video, I'm gonna teach your body how to absorb energy. Now. Absorbing energy is key. You need to be able to land and stick a landing in order to be that powerful jumper. Because in order to be, in order to jump high, you need to be able to, be able to go eccentrically fast and concentrically fast. And the absorbing is what will teach you how to put it all together and it's gonna make you more explosive. Now, the first one we're gonna do, you're gonna stand on here. So I'm using a chair just to show you guys, you don't need plyo boxes, you don't need anything. Any, you could do it off a bench, you could do it off something that's high. Now this isn't very high. If I were to do this in my personal workout, I'm probably going three to four feet. Sometimes I get up to five feet, depending on how my legs feel. So this is only a couple feet off the ground, so I'm just gonna show you guys exactly what the exercise look like. Now, we're gonna go through four of these. The first one is what I call shock jumps. Shock jumps, all you're doing is absorbing the landing. Now guys who are more advanced, make sure you're going off something a little bit higher, because it'll be harder to do. So you're gonna come here, all you're gonna do is lead with one leg, like this, you're gonna fall, and you're gonna land, and you're gonna absorb the landing on your toes like that and you're gonna hold for two to three seconds so after you leave with your left foot now you're gonna leave with your right foot here absorb the landing you're gonna feel it shock your body now there is actually a study done to figure out how much force is actually generated on your body and if you jump off something that's five feet and you land on your feet it's absorbing ten times your body weight into your into your legs all the way through your body so if you weigh 200 pounds you just absorb 2,000 pounds of energy just by jumping off of something, or stepping off of something that was five feet high. So that just goes to show that there's a lot that's tapping into your nervous system. This is gonna take a toll on your body, so make sure you guys do it with caution. Now after you guys are done with that, you're gonna do six total shock jumps. Each of these exercises, you're gonna do just six. Now the next one, now you're gonna land, and you're just gonna jump as high as you can, depth jump. So it's here, and you're just gonna jump. Now we're gonna alternate which foot, Make sure you're swinging your arms to get as much as you can. So you land, jump. As soon as you hit the ground, you jump. You're not coming down like this and then jumping. It's quarter squat, maybe a little bit past 25 degrees, or 20, 25% of the way down. So, done with those. Now we did six of those. The next one we're doing, single leg shock jumps. So it's the same thing we just did. Now we're just landing on one leg. I'm sorry, not what we just did, the first exercise, but now we're landing on one leg. So it's here. Land with this arm up like you're sprinting. So after you're done with your right, now we're just gonna do left. You're gonna step off with your left, and you're gonna land and stick the landing. You're gonna go through six, so three on each leg. Actually, I'm sorry, six on each leg. Last one. We're gonna land, we're gonna do a tuck jump, and then we're gonna land into a lunge. So this one's putting, putting all of these together, and you're gonna land into a lunge to hold it for three seconds. So it's here, tuck, lunge. You're gonna hold that for three seconds. Show you it again. Tuck, launch. All right, so you're gonna put those four into this four part series. So you guys have done part, part one, part two, part three. We're at part four. This is putting it all together for you guys. Do this entire workout, this four part series. Watch what happens to your vertical jump. Let me know how you do. I'd love, I'd love to see your comments below. Do the workout, leave your comment below, make sure you like this video, favorite this video, share with your friends, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys next week. So, yeah, uh, how can I say it so that you will understand? You know that I'm trying to hit it and baby you sitting there pitching it underhand and all of a sudden, yeah. it's back to when I was your man. But I'ma pause your